I call uh, Sarah Dowie. Oh, thank you, uh, Mr Speaker. Um, I rise to take a short call on this climate change response removal of transitional uh, measure amen amendment bill. And um, I'd like to follow on from my colleague, uh, Mr Scott Simpson, who is the chairman of the Local Government and Environment Select Committee, when he referred to this piece of legislation and the, this wonderful budget uh, recently delivered by um, the Honourable Bill Ingl English as pragmatic. And I'd like to add a word to that, um, being balanced. I think that this is a very balanced uh, piece of legislation. It is a balanced way forward uh, to move uh, the emissions trading scheme uh, forward and uh, to meet our international obligations without shirking our duties to our own our own people. And, and what I want to say is that the members opposite uh, seem to fail uh, to remember that this scheme was brought into, into play, the one for two scheme, because of the global financial crisis. And the reason that we brought it in was because we want to support our people and we want to make sure that they had jobs during that time and could generate uh, money for their families and support them. So this was a very pragmatic approach, it was a very balanced approach to allow businesses to move uh, to meeting their obligations uh, with respect to the ETS, um, but not to be militant in a scheme which would mean that people would lose their jobs. So, at the end of the day, this is now um, a balanced way to moving, uh, or phasing out uh, the one to two scheme um, that allows businesses um, to uh, move themselves forward to meet their obligations over that three year period. And I think that that is a positive way forward because this is about uh, protecting the environment, right. acknowledging climate change, and moving um, us forward um, with respect to our international national obligations, um, given that we are an island nation uh, with many uh, coast, well, a very uh, large coastline. Um, but we do need to remember our people. And if you look across what this government is doing, uh, we are being balanced. We are a government that cares about people. We That's care right. about um, our people having jobs, being productive members of society, and having uh, money to spend on their families. Um, um, if you were to be militant with an ETS scheme, uh, jobs would just not be on the table. We wouldn't be producing or um, providing all of these jobs for our people out there um, in our sectors with the growth in tourism, uh, with the growth in manufacturing or the growth in agriculture, uh, we simply would not have that. So look, this is a, a pragmatic approach to uh, phasing the one for two uh, scheme out, but businesses have time to adjust, and I think that is a balanced way forward, and I support this bill. Well said.